what a difference three minutes can make. That's how long it took for the Fredericton Express to turn around what looked to be a lost cause. It's halfway through the second period, and with the hometown Nova Scotia Voyager sitting on a comfortable 5-1 lead and seemingly in control, the Express start their amazing comeback. Veteran Wally Weir all alone in front of these goaltender Mark Holden cashes in on a rebound. Then it's Jim Dobson, the right man in the right place as he redirects the puck into the V's net, and the gap is closed to 5-3. And with the Express rolling now, here comes Gord Donnelly, 14 seconds after that. A nice wrist shot, three goals in three minutes. It's 5-4, and Fredericton is in the driver's seat. Into the third period now, Mark Crawford ties the game on a deflection. Then a quick bang-bang play from the same line, Crawford to Mark Curtin, and the Fredericton Express have taken the lead for good. It wasn't over yet. Again, Crawford converts from Curtin. It's 7-5 with six unanswered Fredericton goals. They traded one each in the last minute of play, 8-6 the final. Express coach Earl Jessamine was understandably relieved. We played 95 games this year, have never lost our composure like that, and from a coaching standpoint, I was very, very concerned, but I went in the dressing room at the end of the first period, explained that, hey, we have done it for 95 games, let's get our composure back. If you play well, you're going to come back, we stand some hope. Hope came through for us. So it's on to Fredericton for the seventh and deciding game of this Northern Division semifinal series, a stunning comeback by the Express. From the Halifax Metro Center, I'm Paul Lethbridge, CBC Sports.